ranks in right now. Um, he plays Puff, and I saw okay. them play a set at Battlegrounds a couple months ago, and uh, Andy went Falcon, and um, yeah, he gave it to him. <laughs> I think it's a better, I mean, it's a better bet, but for, as far as I know, Falcon and Puff isn't like necessarily favorable in Falcons. I think it's favorable in Falcon, but that's just me. Okay. Uh, you have to play really patiently and different than in other matchups. Fair enough. And yeah. uh, a lot of Falcons don't use up air nearly enough. But, like, I know that's surprising, but they, like, go for knees when they shouldn't. Interesting. How do you feel about the, the down throw into rest mix-up that, that has? That uh, is hard to deal with. If you, like, if you think that they're going to go for it, you should just go for up airs and stay safe. Mm -hmm. But, I don't know. What, like, like, next level Falcon meta, would they just, like, get to a point where they down throw, jump, and, like, uh, like, empty... Basically, basically empty short hop into shield the rest and then like falcon punch i if you bait the rest you know I what i mean i think i've seen that i think it'd be a, like a kind of a cool option fal falcons can do yeah that'd be amazing holy crap just thinking about it yeah yeah you know like what the i mean mind game, the level of reading because that's the thing with the rest it's such a wild card like, yeah you the just most throw wild card move like if it hits the heck highest yeah. risk, if not the highest reward heck no yeah Ooh. A lot of puffs against Falcon, especially I notice, go for like rest or uh, pound in neutral, which I think is really unsafe. Against Falcon? Yeah, I've seen it a lot. I wonder why. I don't feel like that wouldn't beat neutral air. No, it doesn't. Like, see? Like there. I don't know. I don't know why he did that. There's no me. reason. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe they get antsy and it's like a panic move. I don't know. I I don't play puff. I don't know what they're thinking. Yeah. Is. But One or two. What's this on the screen? I don't want to like, touch it, but it's bothering me. I think it's a dead pixel or something. Oh, okay. Oh, that's okay, right. Okay, so Dr. Z, it just seems like he's totally controlling this match. And he looks a little frustrated. I think he can, yeah. if he can pull himself together, he can still do this. Oh, good power shield. And nice knee. Yeah, down throw. 100% guaranteed. Yeah. Well, oh, what? The down throw to the knee there? I'm pretty sure. At that yeah. percent? Yeah. I think if you do it right, it's, you can always do it. But if you're frame off and the rest comes out, is yeah. that right? Well, yeah. It's, it gets harder the higher percent you are to, to get the rest out of the down throw knee. But, uh, yeah, so the reason that Andy's been dying is because he's getting himself into unsafe situations, and, like, that just stems from him being impatient, I feel like. How do you feel about uh, the Prime's dash dance game in neutral right now? Because I feel like I feel like Falcon could get a lot more if he, like, spaced aerials out. Like yeah, I, I, what I do, I'm obviously not an authority in the matchup, <laughs> but what I do is I just stand and throw out nares and outbears. And if I'm facing away from them... I feel like that's a better game plan. Yeah. Not that I know anything about Falcon and Puff, but... Because, I don't know, Puff can throw out an F-Smash at any time, and that lasts forever. Oh, the back airs, though. And okay. there's, like, almost nothing you can do about that. Sheridan's Puff style is, like, super, like, like simple but effective. Like, yeah. he doesn't... The way he plays Puff is like how you should play Puff. Yeah, you know? doesn't go anything flashy or excessive. Yeah. He just does. It's like, okay, this works and this works. I'm going to do this. Exactly. You know? Yeah. And I mean, yeah, it works. It's really good. Yeah, and he just three-stocked the Prime. Yeah, yeah. I wonder if the Andy, the Prime... Okay, he stays Falcon. Okay. I I, I think I agree with this. This can work, but it's also it again. really high risk rule high reward because he doesn't have any space to move around. Oh, did you see how he did the shield bait? He like ran forward his shield after the down throw, like maybe waiting for him to rest. That, oh my god. Right, I was just about to say Dr. Z isn't the type of puff that rests often. But oh my god, that was like, perfect. He was a, he was a frame away, yeah. I think, from shielding. Mm -hmm. Jeez. Alright, that worked out in nobody's favor. but <laughs> <laughs> They just traded stocks. Yeah, they just traded stocks. And that, that can be like a good trade for the puff if they think that they're going to have better Don't do it. No. Okay. So, That's I think... super rough. He, yeah, okay. I was going to say he needs to go for a stomp. Combo. Yeah, because I don't think a Falcon Punch would have killed. Falcon Punch wouldn't have killed. Mm. He needed about 5 or 10 more percent. Interesting. Oh my... Why would you go for that? Well, I've seen Hungrybox do that against Spacey's, and Falcon's a semi-fast faller, so he's probably thinking that the weight class would be, wouldn't be too much different. I, I'm also assuming that Dr. Z is... Oh my nice movement God, from the Prime. That was, such that a was good pretty. Move. I that like that. I improved greatly. Yeah. Um, up airs. Thank you for up airing. That's actually so much better than anything else he could have done. So you think up airs are, like, Falcon's answer in this match? Yeah, right? absolutely. To an extent. What, what you, what I do is I up air them until they're about 60 or 70, and then I like 
basically try and win the neutral and get a grab. I think a Paragon, smoke two joints, uh, <laughs> oh, S2J, my bad. I've never heard him refer to that. I don't like, even know why I said his full name. <laughs> S2J played Hungry Box, and um, it was a really close set. Yeah. I think he was like kind of showcasing how Falcon's like, you know, yeah. I don't know, able to do it. I like the Prime's patience right now. Yeah, he's playing a lot more patient than the first game. Yeah, I'd say. absolutely. I think it's that's partially because he got rested twice. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. So okay. if you can tie this up really quickly, okay, nice. he does there it. You okay, go. so back here is actually super strong. Okay, this is tournament time. stock for the prime, um, and game point oh. for Doctor Z. I don't know why he dropped. They're shield. playing on the top platform, kind of flirting up there. I don't know how I feel oh. about that. That could have scared. This might no. Nice. See? Oh my god! I didn't know that was a thing. It's Did he thing. just DI wrong or something? He DI in. He should. He has to DI out. Yeah, yeah. So it okay. works against Fox and Falco too. Wow, that's at higher percent. So they if Puff down throws and they go that way. And I'm pretty sure H Box is the one who discovered that because I saw him doing that. Okay.